close packing in one dimension. Spheres in this type of packing can be arranged only in one way, that is by touching each other in a row. Since each sphere is touching two spheres at a time, therefore coordination number of this arrangement is 2. Close packing in two dimensions. In this type of packing, rows are stacked over each other. Stacking of another row can be done in two ways, which leads to two different types of close packings. Square close packing and hexagonal close packing. In square close packing, the second row is placed in such a way that the spheres of first row are exactly above the spheres of second row. Let's call first row A type row. That means the second row is also called A type row. In the same way, a third row can be placed and called A type row. Therefore, this arrangement is called AAA type of arrangement. Look at the sphere M carefully. Since it is touching four other spheres, the coordination number of this arrangement is 4. On joining the centers of these spheres, a square is formed. That is why this type of close packing is called square close packing. In hexagonal close packing, the second row is placed in the depressions of the first row. If the first row is called A type row, then the second row, which is different from the first row, is called B type row. Now when the spheres in the third row are placed in the depressions of the second row, we observe that the third row formed is exactly similar to the first A type row. Similarly, the fourth row is placed in the depressions of the third row and is called B type row. Due to this, the arrangement is called AB AB type of arrangement. Look at the sphere M carefully. Since sphere M is touching six other spheres, therefore the coordination number of this arrangement is 6. On joining the centers of these spheres, a hexagon is formed. That is why this type of close packing is called hexagonal close packing.